This is the Frameworks desktop microphone stand. All right, so coming in from Gator Frameworks, this is a microphone stand. It's a pro desktop mic stand. Uh, you put your microphone on the top here and it does the rest, keeping it elevated from the table and hopefully level and, uh, and solid enough that it's not going to fall over too easily and hopefully have some kind of vibration reducing tech built into it. In this case, a gasket. Okay, so uh, this is a microphone stand with a six inch round base and at a fixed height of nine inches. Perfect for a podcaster or a desktop mic stand or whatever, or a Twitch streamer if you like. Um, it's going to replace one of those uh, retort stands that, I, uh, that are so famous and so popular that I'm currently using and getting annoyed by. So this costs a whopping $14.99 on Amazon.co.uk and there's a link down below if you want to investigate further. And I'm quite interested to see what you get for $14.99. The box appears to be quite sturdy, I suppose, with lots of sellotape. Um, whether that means that it's been returned before is anyone's guess, but I'm taking it as new. On the back, it has a maximum height, which is 9 inches, base diameter 6 inches, and it's made of steel. They also have stands for these things. Alright, so it doesn't really give you any indication of features or anything on the box, it is just... This is the stand, and this is what it does. So inside the box, which is now empty, we have, I'm guessing this is the stand, and this is the base. Okay, so they, they like their big sellotape in this company here. And we got warnings on the bag to keep away from children. And we have a, a tag with a, a QR code there that goes to the Gator Frameworks uh, website. We stand by our stance. It's got a three year warranty. And they also make other stuff as well. It's pretty heavy. And it's cold. It says G on it for Frameworks. Oh no, for Gator. Uh, it's got some paint on it which is already kind of scratched but I don't mind that at all uh, there's a barcode some rubber around here that's obviously just a strip of rubber that's that's thrown in there and then sealed there slightly uh, adhered to it uh, it is it's kind of rough around the edges but I guess whenever it comes to audio equipment that's that's kind of nice uh, it, it is just a big lump of metal I'd rather have a lump of sort of crudely painted metal than a lump of nice plastic with some weights on it or something this does appear to be quality and then the stand itself okay so we have on the top we have a screw thread um, that is so this is a, a five eight inch screw thread uh, there's a little tightener there for getting a snug fit whenever you put your microphone on the top. Uh, there's another screw thread th there as well, which doesn't seem to be... Well, because it's not adjustable, I can't imagine what, why there's two there, but uh, there is! I'm not going to complain. Then it's been crimped here, where the top has been crimped into the metal frame. There's four crimp marks. Then the Gator Frameworks, slightly nicer looking logo there. We have a clip for your microphone cable, or USB cable, or whatever you happen to have that plugs into your microphone. In my case, it's USB. And then we have the screw thread on the bottom for attaching it to the stand. And it's quite a deep connection between the two. And it doesn't line up perfectly between that and that. But who cares? All right, so that is the stand. I had aspirations of putting this on the top, but it turns out I have a three one eighth or three eighths, 
three eighths inch of a of a connector on there. <clears throat> but that ideally goes on here. Need to get a better shock mount as well, so uh, I'll probably have to maybe just take the opportunity to get myself a shock mount for this. Having done my research very well, I'm buying a stand that is not compatible with what I'm currently using. Poking through my bits and pieces, I've been able to locate something that is acceptable for this kind of thing. And we can put that on there, and our microphone goes happily in there. Uh, with, <laughs> with the shock mount, without the shock mount. But I'm sure we can jerry-rig something between this connection and that connection. So that the shock mount will go on. Groovy. It is it is a good looking piece of equipment. It's heavy, it's solid. It You can hear it hitting the desk there every time I set it down. And hopefully it's not deafening you at home. It's nice that it has a very adjustable, very simple clamp uh, for for your, your USB cable. For £15, it's perfect for the desk. Of course, it would be nice if it were adjustable, but then if it was adjustable, you wouldn't get as much simple quality as this. A piece and a piece that fit together with a screw thread and a microphone goes on top. So I'm going to be starting to use this in the Tech Addicts podcast. I'll put a link down below for you to have a tune in and listen. We're approaching our 300th episode. So let me know if you have any questions or if you have any views or want me to do anything in particular with this. Hit that subscribe button and turn those notifications on. And other than that, take care.